So one of the more tedious things about working with a bunch of Arduino sensors and many different little ESP32s is wiring them all together. And I just recently found out, somebody was like, hey, why do you keep wiring them together? You should just be using ESP now to have them talk. And I was like, ESP now? What, what, what the hell is ESP now? And it's a really lightweight library that uses Wi-Fi. And as long as you have the MAC address, here you can see I have the two different MAC addresses for player one, player two, and a MAC address for my console. So here, what I've mocked up is a really simple way to get data from different sensors and have them communicate with a central hub and have that hub communicate back with them. So I have two UNO files. So I have one for the remotes. And so this file runs on both player one and player two's remotes. And then I have my console, which is running on the core S3. So it's player one's turn. And you can see all I have to do is rotate this to choose where I wanna go. So I'm gonna go, uh, this is a mini encoder unit from M5 stack. And this is running on the M5 stick C plus. So this mini encoder unit has a click capable. So when I click it, you can see it uses, um, we're using ESP now to send the play to the, to the console and the console is sending the board back to the players. So now it's player two's turn to go and I can choose to go here. Whoop, can't go there. Let's go there and player one again here, player two, let's go here, player two is bad, and player three is going to win here, boom, and player one wins. And so this is a really simple demo to try to showcase how easy it is to collect wireless sensor data, and with a couple lines of code uh, inside your Arduino, no connections, all you gotta have is the MAC addresses for the, the parts that you want to send and listen to, and you can wirelessly send and receive uh, extra sensor data between your ESP32s. And I'm gonna share a link to the GitHub repo that has both the console code and the stick code, and hopefully you guys can use it to take a look at how this communication is all working. Cheers.